Afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. We have the Ireland coach, Heinrich Marlin. Afternoon, coach. Right, uh, looking at this tournament, not the best of tournaments that you have had, especially looking at the previous two games coming into the third one. Where do you believe it went wrong for you in this particular game and just how it has been for you throughout this tournament? Yeah, look, obviously it's been a tough week also um, and obviously very disappointing as well all at the same time. Um, look, I, I don't think it's necessarily one piece that we've 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 been poor and there's probably a, a couple of pieces that we we haven't been at our best. Um, look, it'll take a little bit of time to sink in, but um, you know we've we've got a quick turnaround. We've got another game in a couple of days, so you know we got, we've got to be better. Um, come come the last game of the pool stages, and um, you know yeah, just a pretty disappointing day um, in a couple of weeks to be honest. Is there anything in particular that you can point to that has made you not? perform at the best of your abilities? Yeah, like I said, I don't think it's specifically one thing. Um, I think we've just got to be better in most areas. Um, look, we've, we've played, uh, we've tried to play a brand of cricket over a period of time that, that's exciting. Um, you know, we've shown again some of the bigger sides in the last 12 to 18 months that we can do that. Um, and just don't think we've, you know, we've, we've come close to playing the way we wanted to play um, over the last three games. And, you know, hence we, we haven't covered ourselves in too much glory, to be honest. Right, away with the gloom. What positives do you draw out of this tournament of the three games that you've played? Um, what can you say that this is what we can draw from it or what we have learned from it looking forward into the future? Yeah, pretty much the same as I've just answered around. You know, what, 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 what I don't think it's at this stage, with time to reflect now is, you know, it's tough, obviously, because, you know, there's a lot of emotion going around. Um, so we'll, we'll, we'll take 24 hours and reflect a little bit. Like I said, we've got a quick turnaround and we've got to be up for the next game against the UAE. Um, and, you know, then there's another couple of games after that as well. Um, and then we've got a short turnaround to the World T20 qualifiers as well. So, look, there'll be a proper port most of them um, at the end of this. Um, but, you know, at the minute, we've, we've got to make sure that we, we, we get ourselves in a place where we can compete and come back and, um, you know, start building a bit of momentum. Now, just looking at um, the camp right now, I know it's sad right now, but... Um, at the end of the day, it's about also looking at the positives. Now, looking at um, UAE and how it has been has been playing, then looking at how you guys have been playing, and now focusing on the next match, of which he did he did touch a bit about it. But what is it that you you would um, bring that is new to make sure that you do beat um, uh, the the UAE? Yeah, we just got to be a little bit more consistent in all facets. Um, you know, whether it's batting, bowling, or fielding, I think at times we've done that really well. We've seen some individual performances, but we haven't seen. From a unit or a team point of view, that collectiveness um, that gets you across the line in, in, in big games and in big competitions. Um, and, you know, when you play these competitions and you play these series, you, you need those collective performances. And um, hopefully we can see a couple of those at the back end of this campaign. Lastly, Coach, now looking at this performance, do you feel under pressure from back at home in terms of what the expectations were and how you are looking to finish this tournament. What sort of pressure do you feel under right now? I think international cricket, you always feel pressure. Um, so there's no difference in, in, you know, a week ago or leading into the UAE game. Uh, it's international cricket. It's a tough place to be at, at times. Um, we'll be better off for this once the dust settles. Um, you know, but it's, it's about making sure we, we create that environment where we can reflect, we can learn, um, we can go out there, we can... Uh, do our work, um, prep well, um, and, and allow the boys to go out there and, and play what's in front of them with some freedom um, and hopefully some smiles on our faces in the not-too-distant future. Good luck in your next game, Coach. Thank you.